as the radioactive materials, if they are being released, travel away from the plant, they will be greatly diluted. What happens is you may have a, a release of material, but as soon as it is released, it disperses, which reduces the doses substantially. So even though there may have been somewhat elevated levels in Tokyo, this was have been a trivial increase in um, background radiation there, at least at the present time. There were some levels at the edges of the plant that were reported for very short time periods, which then dropped. Um, but at that point, the individuals uh, in the members of the public had already been evacuated from that zone, and the levels dropped very, very quickly. There has been a single worker who received a large dose as of last night, uh, and that dose was twice the uh, legal limit for workers in the United States. Uh, so even the cancer risk to that individual would have been small. That's as of this morning. Three Mile Island, there were totally trivial releases of radioactive material in terms of their health impact on the general public. At the current time, that would have been the case in Japan. This is not a Chernobyl situation insofar as the reactors are concerned. Um, it is not possible for all of the materials in the core to become airborne, as was the case in Chernobyl. This is much more of, at the current time, an event that's like Three Mile Island, which had trivial consequences outside the edges of the plant perimeter.